Hello people out there, so today I'm going to be doing a video that I've been putting off for a while, mostly due to the fact that I don't want to be yelled at for my opinions, also procrastination, but I think it's finally time to. So I'm going to be talking about what I hate about FNAF gotcha videos. I have a lot of problems with these videos, like with a use. A lot of people make that a excuse when people point out something that seems wrong and doesn't fit FNAF. This mostly goes to shipping and how characters act. Like, Softy William, mean Mrs. Afton, you get the point. Also a lot of a use are just copies, like everyone is doing the same thing. Barely anything is original about the AU, and mostly seems like what the gotcha community made canon. Like, there has to be Chris Afton, Glitchtrap has to be a part of William and or controlled him to kill kids, Elizabeth has to be a jerk or a crackhead, Ennard has to be with Michael 24-7 and has to be living inside of him. I see it all the time, and god forbid if you have a different theory, like if you believe Michael is the crying child, you get spammed with, where is Chris, Michael is not the crying child you idiot. I don't think these people understand what having opinions is and believing different theories are just being more original than what the gotcha community has been shoving down our throats. This is also why I was kinda scared to post any FNAF videos with my AU. Next is shipping. I need bleach for what some people ship, and yes I know everyone's ships are valid, but not when they involve pedophilia, incest or just don't make sense. Like William X any of the animatronics, you do realize he killed those kids, and he is an adult, and do you really think those kids would want to be in a relationship with the person who killed them and is the reason why they're possessing the suits and are miserable? Yeah, I didn't think so. There is also William X glitch trap or spring trap, they are the same person, that is just weird, and not the good kind. Now on to Michael X Ennard, I hate this ship so much, it grosses me out. Ennard makes up all the fun time animatronics meaning Elizabeth is a part of Ennard, also the main five dead kids might also be there, that goes into a theory I believe, and probably Mrs. Afton is there. Do you see the problem, but people just make the excuse, it's my AU and Ennard isn't made up of the fun times. Then Ennard shouldn't exist. Shipping the dead kids together is fine, but there is a line that should never be crossed and that's when you sexualize it. Like making them kiss, make out, and doing the nasty, that is gross, these are kids, they shouldn't even know about that stuff, they're also possessing, in animatronic suits which is impossible for them to do stuff like that. I feel like they would just have little crushes and have a cute little wholesome kid relationship. Not any of that kissing, making out, doing the nasty, you heathens. This is why this community can't have nice things. Another thing is, why can the Afton family turn into their animatronic forms and can go back to being human? That doesn't make sense. And why can they only do it and not the other dead kids? And don't say it's because William made the animatronics, because so did Henry, so shouldn't the marionette, who is Henry's daughter, Charlie be able to do that? Also don't say it's because they are dead, you'll just look stupid and it won't help your argument at all. The next one is what really bothers me, no one cares about what William did, and if you do, you are a jerk and hated by everyone. Like in singing battles, Afton Family vs FNAF1, the dead kids are made to look like jerks in those videos. If I saw my murderer, I'd be pissed too. They have the right to be mad. I also hate when people make the dead kids, Henry or the rest of the Afton Family forgive William, and if you don't forgive him, you're a jerk and everyone hates you. William ruined all of these people's lives and is the reason why they died. Like, WTF why would you forgive him? Another thing is when people say, Glitchtrap controlled William to kill kids. Glitchtrap is a part of William's subconscious in the VR game is a virus. Glitchtrap didn't even exist back then. Also Glitchtrap is William, so William still killed the kids. Now back to Michael. Anytime Michael is in a video and he is alone, or just anytime he is in a video, Ennard is there because he is inside Michael. Michael puked out Ennard after a week of having Ennard inside of him, Ennard shouldn't be near Michael. Also small thing, when people say Ennard scoops Michael, he's forgiven, but when they say Elizabeth did it, she deserves to die. Again, but back onto the main thing I was talking about. People, if they don't ship them, make them like best friends, why? I don't know. I think Michael would be kinda scared to see Ennard after what happened, but no, they are completely fine with each other. It's also very unoriginal at this point, and very overused, like everyone in this community does it, I'm done seeing it. It's very rare if I see someone who doesn't do it. I think you can tell I have a lot of problems with FNAF gotcha videos, and please don't take this as me attacking these people, and if you feel offended by this video or attacked, I'm sorry. I just wish that more people would make their AUs follow the lore of the game more or just make their AUs make sense and or explain it. Only some people do this.
Anyways, I hope you enjoyed my video, goodbye.